it's like a furnace at the top of the Iron Lady. It's a direct quote that crushed a lot of vacation dreams this week. You know how we're always talking about how climate change messes and takes away the things we love? Exhibit A, it just happened across Europe. Okay, so countries like the UK, Spain, France, Portugal, hit with historic dangerous heat. Just between July 1st and 2nd, over 147 million people were exposed to heat that was made at least three times more likely because of climate change. Over 104 million of those people faced heat that was almost impossible without or at least five times more likely to occur because of climate change. And that's just residents. Doesn't include the number of tourists that were there as well. So the impacts, the Eiffel Tower literally closed its summit. Too dangerous on a day where the high was 38.3 degrees Celsius, 101 degrees Fahrenheit, basically just turning it into a pressure cooker. Meanwhile, at Wimbledon, the hottest opening day ever recorded, and play had to stop because fans needed medical attention in the stands. It's being called the day that felt like Florida. And remember, this isn't the first big heat wave of the summer for Europe. Generally, with climate change, what we know is that heat waves are longer. They're more intense and they're more frequent. So sure, they build in, they go away, but then they tend to come back, much like what we've seen this summer. Want to check out Climate Change's fingerprint on this extreme heat event? Go give the data a gander. It's up right now at csi.climatecentral.org.